right, I've just opened the cart. Quite an enchantment. The carts are returning to arm. There you go. I just opened the door. Sorry, I just had to go talks me to sell some of the items so that I can get Where some new are? items there you go the guy is gonna get his cart back you know what I'm, I'd rather fight than stay hidden Rebellion. like this yeah are. come on come on come on try hitting me go on you're dead what about this one that was quite something He's dead. That was indeed quite something. So, why is this one here? Wait. Let me use, um... Which one is it again? Oh, I forgot. Oh, yeah. There you go. Um, let's call the... Akio. Yeah. Akio. There you go. Got it. Okay, I've got a new hat. Which Rebellion. probably is better... Than my current one. There's nothing else to see here. And on my way here, I surprisingly saw something very interesting. I'm just gonna go there qu qu quickly. This ancient material. Wait, before I go there, maybe I should, you know, acquire this fire thing as well. Confringo. Oh no, not Confringo. There you go. I look the visual right now. It looks quite nice. It's not the best one, but it's not that bad either. Okay. All right. Off so another adventure, are we? So the thing I found is this ancient magic hotspot. I wonder. Yeah, let's go and see. The Professor Rock would it say something about that? What's in there? What's this thing called? So it's just a layer of I should investigate. Wait, wait. I'm just gonna go and kill this. Should I? Oh, no, I'm not gonna kill them right now. I'll come and kill you! people later I guess he should investigate so where should he investigate oh yeah this is the one but before I get here I'm just gonna quickly go and grab that ancient magic let's run I like this night nice, this These thing have seen better days oh come on is there an enemy I'm coming I'll probably be able to make my ancient magic better now. Okay. Rebellion. So I'm supposed to go this way, I guess. You know what? I'm gonna kill this guy. Yeah, die. Wow, I sent oh, him flying. A deadly great spot. I sent him flying. Ah, oh, come on. Rebellion. Wait. How am I supposed to get to the other side, though? Okay. Can I break the door or something? How do I get there? By flying? It is possible to... Wait. Yeah, I thought so. Didn't make sense. Why is landing unavailable? So what did I get though? What did I really get? I wonder. 
anyways so yeah and now let's get to that cave I guess let's see what's in there um Akio come on Akio I don't know why does it not open like that. Just something I'm doing wrong. I guess I'm doing it wrong somehow, probably. Probably I'll have to keep it maybe like this. Or I don't really know. Still have no clue. See, it illuminates and then. I've no clue really. If I live, forget it. should push it another thing I'm thinking um, can I I don't think I can I think it's only for the within cast room of requirement nothing else so yeah these are the spells of they illuminate sometimes However, I have no clue. Anyways, I'll learn it later on, I guess. For now, I'm just gonna leave. This place has seen better days. There you go. I want to unlock those flying pests, you know. If there you go, bro. My wares, I'm on. I have good news. Your carts are on their way back. I don't, I don't know what to say. Any hope I have of getting my belongings back was quickly fading. Ramrock's lot called me a fool for believing in the good and wizard kind. Thank you for proving them wrong. Wasn't the trouble. Uh... I managed to free your carts fairly easily. Oh, I'm glad you're all right. Oh, I can't wait to have my things back, especially my paints. <gasps> you know, you've inspired me. I've been dealing with witches and wizards for years, and we've always got along just fine. Perhaps my next piece will be a tribute to all that is good between us. Sounds wonderful. What a nice idea, Ron. I wish you luck with it. Oh, I can't wait to get started. Uh, thank you again for all you've done. You're welcome. I guess. So, all I've unlocked something new. Once my carts arrive, I'd be happy to show you my wares. Okay. It's like a place right out of a storybook. It is a beautiful place, yeah, I admit. Anyway, so, um... The next one I wanted to do was, uh, let's see, Troll Boogies. Wait, which one did I want to? Okay, practice flying near the spirals. I wanted that one. Okay, let's unlock a new spell, I guess. So it's this way.
You know what I'm gonna do? Let's put the hood on and see how it looks. Now it looks like uh, women now. What's happening? Alright, something happened, I don't know what. Oh, come on. Why does it keep on going up? I wonder. Is it something wrong with the... L I don't know, really. I hate these bugs. Sometimes it happens. It's probably with this space button. There you go, now it seems okay. All right, let's go. It's probably these things. Am I supposed to? Okay, so it makes me fast. Anyways. How am I supposed to practice the flying? Okay, so it's again the popping balloon thingy. You must be joking me. What does this lady want? No balloon in the entire Hogwarts Legacy map? I mean, does she want me to pop up all the balloons in this world? What does she have? I mean, does she have some kind of, I don't know, rivalry with the balloons? Does she hate it? It could be anything. She probably had something with the balloons. Probably the children didn't let her play with balloon, and now she hates them. And she wants the all the pages. Probably had some sort of, I don't know, rivalry with balloons. She hates balloons for some reason. And, um, yeah, no, she doesn't like them. She wants all the balloons in the world to vanish. Oh, should I go the year? What is this place called? Feldcroft. Anyway. I'm gonna go with to Kindridge for now. And I'm just gonna complete that little quest that woman wants. She wants more balloons to be dead. Jew. This time, however, she paraphrased the sentence. <laughs> she didn't say destroy the balloons. She just said, um, yeah, <laughs> oh man, practice flying, is that what you call practicing? I feel bad for these balloons. Here, I, wonder. I don't care who lived here, I only wonder about the, no, the mysterious thing. <laughs> Okay. So there's a chest. I hope there's something beautiful in here. Rebellion. Nothing interesting though. How do I get there? Nothing interesting I guess. It's gonna go there. Okay, now again I identified. I don't really know why. Why is... Isn't that completely pointless? It doesn't make any sense. Sometimes these video games can do s stupid things. Anyways. I'm gonna go kaboom. There you go. Oh wait, I forgot. Missed all the nitros, booster, whatever. It. There you go, Mrs. Whatever balloon balloon haters or whatever. I'm coming. It's 
probably in there, right? I'm just gonna go there, learn the new lesson. And I guess after that, I'm just gonna get on with the next quest. Yes, yes. Have you finished your assignments? I have indeed. Reporting back, Professor. Assignments all well done. Shows mm -hmm. wisdom is a golden snitch, as they say. Let us practice our restore momentum. Okay. A precise, deliberate movements. Oh no no no. Sorry. Very good. I recommend practicing your new spell as much as possible. Perhaps before you leave here. Okay. Which one is it again? Uh, this one. Alright. Let's see him. Um. Okay, so these are the objects for me to practice. That's it. Keep it up. Okay. So how for how long do they stay like this? Not bad. Can I cast this on them as well? No, it doesn't work on the paintings, I guess. All right. Okay, so um, the next quest seems to be... B ah, Beast Class, finally! Okay, why did I not see that? Okay... Oh, silly me. Confringo. Not Confringo, man. What's up with you and Confringo? You keep on doing Confringo on everything. I don't really get it. Okay, so for Beast... Plus, I'm not gonna be hiding my face, I guess. And I've got a new one of these as well. Ugly ones. A new eyewear as well. I have no clue what that is. Okay, okay this looks cool. <laughs> I'm just gonna wait and learn how to ride a beast. So that probably is this woman the teacher? Okay, let's start. Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. Though be advised, okay. none of these creatures should be taken lightly. They are all in their own way dangerous, especially if one does not know how to handle them properly. Now, it seems many of you are out of practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howen. Hello, I'm Poppy, Poppy Sweeting. Don't worry about Professor Howen's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly safe. Oh! Miss Sweeting, pay attention, please. The tongue of a puffskin can be a slippery devil. Uh, <laughs> yes, Professor. The Professor was right. Here, you can practice on Gerald. Just keep an eye out for his tongue. <laughs> it's a nice beast. You can use my brush. What happened Just to my... Gentle. Oh, and think pleasant thoughts. I like to think it enriches his experience. What happened to the FPS again? Right? 
so tap T and that's the brush for real okay that's lovely I'm sure he feels much better I think he might be hungry would you mind giving him some beast feed? Again, tea. Some food. Go on, eat. I thought it was what do you different type of beast. What tastes like to Gerald? Pudding, I like to think. I think we can safely say that Gerald likes you. That's good news. He seems very nice. He is. Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition. And cleanliness. Good work, everyone. Now, let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. And please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. What's Miss the Sweeting, point of doing this? Why don't you show our new student to the measles in the farthest pen? This way. The measles are over here. I mean, if I can use them, that's a different story, but... Otherwise, it's completely pointless, isn't it? I don't know if I can use them, though. Guess I'll check. We'll find out. Oh, couple of knees or whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy something from Honey Jeeks. <laughs> <laughs> That's a nice beast. Stupid thing. Oh. <sighs> what in Merlin's name are you doing? Ugh. Tus tus, peculiar poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent. Her name is Persephone. <laughs> Her name is Persephone. <laughs> <laughs> That's really not funny. Okay. <sighs> Let's go. Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. Coaches in training. Persephone was on to them instantly. Thank you for your help. Let's carry on. Feed and brush the measles just as you did with Gerald. Oh, isn't it pointless though? Why would I do that? <laughs> the measles really took to you. They know a good egg when they see one. As do I. It appears our time has come to an end. Please close the pens and see yourselves out. Now, where is our new student? Ah, there you are. What would you like from like me? would like a moment, please. Of course, of course. Everybody likes to have a moment with the new student. I wonder what's the point, really, of doing this thing. Isn't it completely pointless? Forget it. Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first beast lesson? Should I be... Nah, don't, don't make me nervous. I didn't enjoy it, it either. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. I don't Good. think so. You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. Some provide us with magically imbued materials, if cared for correctly, which Do does not include torturing them for whiskers. Well done, by the way. Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, Professor. They're nearly as bad as the savages in Rookwood's poacher pack. <sighs> Sadly, we're the ones who suffer, stumbling over dead beasts. Terrible waste of resources. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice by someone. The Ministry, perhaps? Hmm. An optimistic idea. Now, why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other fifth years. Be on the lookout for my owl. Okay. Meanwhile, I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. 
Okay. Psst, psst. Over here. What do you want? Do you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to those brutes so that I didn't have to. You were an augury at noon in the desert. I certainly hope that's a good thing. It's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. At least, that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't stand there and watch them harm the poor thing. We're of a similar mind. Actually, in light of that, there's someone I'd like you to meet in the forest. Okay. You've intrigued me. Very well. Lead the way. I'd hoped I would. Do you think it's one of the flying beasts? I hope I it is. I just anyone there. In fact, you're the first. Really? Well, thank you. I think. As I said, we think alike. Pleasant surprise. <sighs> Quite the weather we're having, don't you think? Poppy, where are you taking me? It really is much better if I just show you. My character doesn't like her. Or, or I mean, should I say, doesn't trust her. Sorry, we're nearly there. It's just ahead. I will, I hope it's a flying beast, please. Stand back. Please. Otherwise it's completely punched. Oh it is a flying beast. Oh yes, it is a flying beast. That's a very nice one. Not a very nice one, but it's a good one. Yes, a good one. Please meet High Ring. Isn't she just magnificent? The Harry Potter did write that. Go on, Similar. introduce yourself to her. But be careful. You must always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before you approach them. Bo for real. I knew it. I don't think I've ever seen a hippogriff take to someone this quickly. You can feed and brush her if you'd like. I come and check on her every once in a while. Bring her pasties, tell her what's going on in the castle. You wouldn't know from looking at her, but she's a dreadful busybody. Oh, she loves me. Cool. I find it really funny to see those bubbly hearts <laughs> flying over their head. What will I get to ride it? <laughs> it flew away. So. What did you think of High Wing? Okay, she was brilliant. I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe you introduced me to her. I suspected you two might get along. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hmm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and High Wing cross paths? It's a longer story, but I rescued her from poachers a few years back got her to safety and well she was fine until recently you may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem in the area so i worry they could get her again and that i might not be there next time professor howen mentioned the poachers as well she seemed to imply that we couldn't rely on the ministry to help i don't often agree with professor howen but on that i fear she's right the poachers influence is growing I see them every day in the village, lingering, talking to people. They're up to something. I'm just not sure what. Okay. That does seem strange. Sounds as if they're planning something. Exactly. I think I'm going to look into it. Find out what's going on. What they're doing. It would be good to investigate. I think that's a fine idea. Information is power. And the more I know, the better I can keep Hiring safe. You seem undeterred. 